That's over. Thanks for saving my business. No problem. Thanks for the percentage. Now all I need to do is build a garage. How's that gonna work? Just you watch. Here it is. The world premier grand opening at Jim Rob's Garage. The service center has all the tools you need to customize your ride. And if you see a car out there with something you like, bring it on in. Now that we're in business, let's talk shop. Hey, JR, if we're short on parts, why don't we just steal them? We could run a little chop shop here. Now that would save us a pretty penny. I need some parts for a hammerhead. How about you get me one of those? Gallo's about to start for the Hummingbird Codex unveiling. I want your security team in place. It's your night to shine.
All right, team. Tonight's a big night, so nobody fuck it up. You, uh, Johnson, is the Codex ready for its entrance? Roger that. It's in position, and the display case hover tech is green. Good. I love this tech. Thank you for coming here this I'm gonna check in with the boss. We Antonio's speech should be wrapping up. To join us for this very special celebration. Now, the Bravo, team. How's it hanging? Uh, fine. Thirty years ago, I was a young intern. At the I saw that. Museum Just kidding. Relax. When a gang of thieves stole, and of course, thanks to each and every one of you, your donations tonight will benefit the international effort to end illegal traffic of stolen antiquities. <laughs> Mr. Marshall, how was your evening, sir? Fine, fine. But I don't see our guest of honor. Where's my hummingbird codex? They'll be escorting it in any moment. That's what I like to hear. Have you met Myra Starr? She's on the Marshall Board of Directors. How do you do, ma'am? Quite well. So, you're Atticus's new hotshot. That's what it says on my ID badge. Oh, talented and confident. Reminds me of a younger me. Now, nah, what say we celebrate? Go get yourself a drink. Yes, sir. Smile. The press is here in force. Your security is in good hands. What do you think you're doing? You don't drink on duty. I'm following orders. Atticus told me to celebrate. <laughs> of course he did. You want a word of advice? Watch your step around Atticus. He only sees results. No problem. That's what I give him. Uh-huh. Hey, what happened to not drinking on duty? I'm not on duty. Have you ever met Atticus Marshall? Now there's a self-made man. Hey, Nina, I can't talk. I'm working security. That's why I'm calling. Los Panteros are about to try to take the Codex back. What? Are you sure? Yes, I'm driving getaway. I'd have called sooner, but I wasn't alone. Fuck. When? Nina, get off your phone. We're going in. Shit. Mr. Marshall. Get this under control. It's an embarrassment to the company. Yes, sir. Oh. Ah. Ah. God, I hope Nina's not in this mess. Secure the codex. I'll get Atticus out of here. Hey, I'm in charge here. You get Atticus out of here, I'll secure the codex. Uh-huh. on the codex you nuts that place is full of panteros it's faster i can handle them Take the codex. We will 
kill you all! We will bring the gift of anarchy to Santo Eliso! We are the idols! Fear us! Idols too? Thanks for the heads up, Kev. What happened to the roommate code? Monument to greed you built. The oppressors drink and laugh while the enslaved clean up their table scraps. Your so called Society is a failed experiment. It's time to put it to an end. Time to wash it away. Time to make some noise. Get ready for a whole new world with no pharaohs, no gods, no idols, but us. from there. Codex. I've secured Atticus. I need to find the rest of the board. I'll get the Codex to the safe room. How the fuck do I move it? Your Marshal ID triggers the sensor. It'll move on its own as long as you stay close. Got it. Access granted. Emergency transport initiated. Hover systems re-engaging. Recalculating.
Cover systems re-engaging. Systems re engaging. Get that one. I've got the codex. Approaching the safe room. I need backup. This thing is getting buggy. for escort. <laughs> Cover systems re-engaging. What the fuck? Blow it! Waiting for escort. Fuck! Shit, the codex is still up there. Fucking hover tech. Somebody report! I got separated from the Codex. Anyone have eyes on it? Negative! I got nothing! It's just chaos here! Damn it, the door's blocked. Need something to bust through that gate. Busted RPG? No fixing that. Rocket! Need something to fire it with. I have an idea. Shit, that worked. Sergio? Let's go, motherfucker! Yes! Gwen? Gwen! I'm good.
Everybody goes! is one big asshole. Gwen, you're alive. Don't celebrate yet. Sergio got away. I got most of the board locked down, but I can't find Myra Star. Stop it. Keep an eye out for him. Burn for the collective! Mini gun? Thank fuck. You going up again? Oh, someone help me. Miss Star, hang on, I'll cover you. Oh god, let's see. Better find cover. I'll hold them off. Sergio's ordering Los Panteros to fall back. Did he get the codex? No, and he's pissed. I gotta drive. See you at home. You can come out, Miss Star. It's safe. Thank you. Thank you so much. You are really good at this. Not my first time shooting up a place with a minigun, ma'am. Just first time people are happy I did it. How the fuck did this happen? Shit. What's going on, sir? You. Sir, I know I made a little mess protecting the museum, but we have to look at the big picture. The threat's been neutralized, Mistar is safe, and as you can see, the Codex is secure. A mess? Yes, there is a goddamn mess. I don't... I don't understand. Well, you were wasting time with her. The idol stole the Codex and replaced it with a fake. Sir, I wasn't wasting time. I was saving... Do you think I give a shit if Myra Star lives or dies? Atticus. You are replaceable. You are replaceable. That was not. Sir. I can lead a team to retrieve the Codex. The hell you can. You're fired. What? You're done. If I see you on Marshall property again, I'll have you shot. We'll make this right, Antonio. I promise. Thank you. I am sorry. are planning on attacking the museum. Hey, it's Kev. I, uh, I made you breakfast if you want some. That's cool if you don't. Nina wasn't hungry either. Uh, 
Uh. I'm sorry about last night. I didn't hear about the museum until it was too late to warn you. The Collective don't tell me shit. You should come to the Idols party with Eli and I later. Open bar? No? Mm. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go. Just, uh... Just know that Eli and I are worried about you guys. Later. Well, looks like we both got fucked over. Yeah. No work today? I'm leaving Sergio's group text on red. Fair. Los Panteros have been going downhill since he started leading. We used to be about family. Now it's all about him. Plus, he's zero for two this week, and that just makes him pissy. I want to eat my feelings. Oh, come the fuck on. God damn it. Stupid refurbished appliances. Figures. Welcome back to the Cutting Room, the premier auction experience for knife connoisseurs of all ages. Our first stop, Lung Piercer, a contemporary update on the classic Shiv, the Lung Piercer. Looks like we got a shopper in Santa Waliso that knows their stabbing implements. Let's bring out the next item. It's been a hell of a day here on the Cutting Room, but I've been saving the best for last. The Judas 3000. If Brutus had had one of these bad boys, he wouldn't have needed the Senate to help stab Caesar. How many knives did you end up buying? Not enough. Hey, Sergio just texted us. <sighs> he has to be pretty pissed. Yeah, says he's planning on attacking the idols party. Man, I'd hate to be the idols right now. Everyone at that party is probably gonna get killed. Sucks to be Kevin Eli. Yeah. Oh shit! You gotta go! They're not coming, are they? They'll get over it, man. Don't worry about it. <sighs> They're totally pissed at me. They'll get over it. Give them time. You mind if I get a drink? You do you, man. Can I have a white wine spritzer? You okay? I, I I don't think so.
Get in and drive fast. Where's the party? The resort. We gotta move. Try to get a hold of Eli. I'm gonna call Kev. Come on, come on, come on. He picking up? Nothing. You? Yo, no. this is Kevin. Fuck. My phone's I got voicemail. Silent, so leave Same a message here. after I drop the beat. Wait for it. Wait for it. Kev, call me. I'm gonna call Sergio. Maybe I can put a stop to this. He'll never listen. It's worth a try. Well, look who decided to get back to me. Sergio, you gotta call this off. My friends are in there. I'm the friend you should be worried about. You are taking Los Panteros to war just because you think Marshall and the Idols embarrassed you. You're saying some shit you're gonna regret, Nina. Call it off or I quit. You ain't gonna quit. Try me. He's calling. Kev's calling. Put it on speaker. Kev, you all right? I'm fine, but Eli- They fucking shot me! You're doing great, Eli. Stay cool. Where are you guys? Eli's behind the bar. I'm keeping him covered. Nina and I are on our way. Keep Eli alive. Got it. Please don't hang up! Eli, listen to me. Nina and I are gonna kill every motherfucker standing between us and you. And that means we're gonna need both hands, okay? Okay. You're gonna be fine. I promise. Shit, the Panteros group chat is blowing up. They set up roadblocks on the bridges. We're gonna have to go through your crew, Nina. Those Panteros aren't my crew anymore. Eli and Kev are all that matters. You ready? Let's get our boys back home. Ugh, Nina! She's turned on us! No! Those Panteros turned on me! Here. We're gonna get you out, but you'll have to walk. Oh. I'll try. Shit. Shit? Shit what? What now? Los Panteros should have left the party crashing to the experts. Looks like you're gonna back the fuck off. No, 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 no! They're cool, they're with me. If they're with you, then 
can you get to kill them? Guess this is my last idol's party. You don't need this fucking cult anyway, Ken. What she said. Let's finish what you started and get Eli out of here. Yes, please. Honey, you were getting out of here. Not in one piece. Guess we're all quitting today. You and your friends are obsolete. Okay, Eli, let's go. Oh man, we're in the shit now. We just pissed off the idols and Los Monteros. Yeah, big time. So let's not stick around until they come back. Agreed, let's move. Acceleration. Oh, what about the gas mileage? Fuck the gas mileage! Panteros are coming after us. That's it. I've had enough for one day. Keep driving. I'm gonna teach these fuckers a lesson. You sure? You got them coming up fast. Well, I got an RPG and some shit to work out. So let's see how that goes for them. That's right. I don't want to die before I make my first million. I'm not gonna die. I got you, buddy. Ugh. So much blood. Play Eli's audiobook. It always calms him down. Perfect. Oh, not this again. Hey, I can use some positivity right now. Turn it up. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. Realize that power. Your own boss of your job, of your happiness, of your life. You don't make this stuff. Yes, I want it. You're selling hours of your life away for 15 bucks a week. So what do I say to the person who wants to get paid what they deserve? Fuck, uh, this thing corners like a boat. Uh, every turn makes it hurt worse. Life. Stay with us, Eli. Life We're almost out of this. And but if you want to learn to hear this thing, instead of getting stuck with someone uh, else, there's a doctor. These fuckers are relentless. I know how to lose them. Stay low. You better. You deserve better. You are more than a cog in a corporate machine. You are not defined by your stupid set. Hang or on. Your useless degree. If your life is stuck in neutral, there's only one person to blame. Uh, Nina? Not now. Ooh, damn. Nice job. 
never doubt me. Let's get Eli somewhere safe. Why aren't we at the hospital? Because you don't have insurance. I don't really care. You would if you saw what they charged to fix a flesh wound. Kev, where's the... Hall closet, Yo, Kev. top shelf. Okay, this is gonna suck, buddy. Oh, fuck! You're doing great. You're being very brave. Fuck you. Hey, keep talking to Kev like that, and you won't get a star on the star chart. <laughs> Ow! Oh, what are we gonna do? Finish sewing you up? Yeah, and then what? The Idols and Panteros aren't exactly our number one fans right now. Isn't that obvious? We're starting a criminal empire. What? Your car was right, Eli. About everything. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? Guys, we're really good at what we do. So why are we doing it for other people and not ourselves? I mean, you know how to start a business. Kev knows how to get attention. <laughs> I'm a walking murder party. And Nina? Nina's the best goddamn driver in the business. Who could touch us? Hell, we just took on two crews at once and walked away just fine. I was shot. And you're getting a sticker, so quit bitching. I'm in. Fuck yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Eli? Guys, this is a little crazy. What happened to there being a difference between surviving and thriving? Well, I survived being shot, and now I want to thrive without being shot again. Nina's down. Kev's down. Snickerdoodle is definitely down. Oh, do not bring her into this. Eli, this cat suffers no fools. <laughs> and neither should you. Uh. Is that a yes? Yeah, it's a yes. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started.
Hey, just a reminder, we're having our first company meeting in a bit. Don't be late. Company meeting. Nice euphemism. I'll be right there. Dreams come true. I don't know, guys. What do you think? I feel like there's a lot we're missing. There is, but it's enough to go on for now. What about criminals? Don't we kind of need more than three if we want to call this thing an empire? There's four of us. Oh, are you planning on shooting anyone? After that party, I think I'll stick to metaphorical blood on my hands. Yeah, that's less useful when people try to kill us. Nina's right. We need more people. We'll look more legit if we have a home base. You saying we're not legit already? Oh, I love you, but I'm allergic. <clears throat> yeah, point taken. All right, let's brainstorm. What would our place need? I gotta be able to host some parties and have more than a fucking galley kitchen to work with. I wanna be able to set up a proper garage to work in. I don't think Sergio's gonna be letting me near the forge anytime soon. That's good. What you got? I don't know, a ball pit? I'm joking. Kind of. I'm kind of joking. It needs to be defensible. We pissed off a lot of people, and let's not kid ourselves. They're gonna try to kill us. You're fun. Hey man, just being real. For me, we needed to be cheap. We don't have a lot of cash, so we'll probably be looking at a fixer-upper. So, we need an open space for the interior, a decent plot of land to build a garage, it's gotta hold up in a firefight, and it's gotta be dirt cheap. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be a bitch fine. I got it! Holy shit, we are so good at this. There's an old church near Fort Cullen. The sanctuary is huge. I can turn the rectory into a garage. It's condemned, so it's cheap. And it's got a fucking graveyard, so we can stash the bodies. You fucking rock. What are we waiting for? Let's check this place out. Let's go. I'll drive. Where is this church? Up on 3rd. Oh, that place. Guys, look at these pictures. The architectural details look amazing. Let me see. Mina, this place is in ruins. I said it was a fixer-upper. There's a fine line between fixer-upper and money pit. Relax. The listing says it's being restored by a developer, John Bland. John Bland? The real estate king of Santo Aliso? Is he the guy on all those billboards? Why does a guy that into self-promotion stick with a name like Bland? Bland is no Roger McGillicuddy, but if he does restore the place, and we can still get it for cheap, it might work out. Assuming the restorations preserve the original facade. You're not gonna worry about preservation when I put in my state-of-the-art kitchen, are you? We can discuss that later.
That's a lot of heavy equipment for a renovation. Looks more like a demolition crew. He's gonna restore this place in the condos. Not if we do something about it. to demo a demo crew. Got him. Demolition crew. Attention. Attention! This property is protected by Marshall Defense Industries. Park the bulldozer and come out with your hands off! What the fuck are these Marshall Rent-A-Cops doing here? Shit. Bland must contract with them for security. Oh, fun. Hang tight. I'll take care of them. <laughs> <laughs> 